Are you guys ready for another Friday couples duel with cereal mystery boxes though? Welcome back to the channel guys. You're watching Slapshot Pops. I'm John. And I'm Joanna. And welcome to another Friday couples duel video. Only today we have a few different things for you guys. We don't have any Funko Pop mystery boxes, but we have some cereal mystery boxes as well as our first ever ever Lego duel. And uh, we also have some fan mail to open up. We're very excited. And uh, we'll be eating cereal today to review on the channel. And we had to do that because all of these boxes actually come with a limited figure inside. And there's a chance for a gold chase. So you can't get any better than that. Eating cereal and could possibly find a chase. We're going to do it today here on Slapshot Pops. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. And we hope that you join our team. Subscribe to our channel and check out all of our great content and everything we do here on the channel. For everybody returning, thank you guys so much. Your support means the world. And we're gonna jump into today's exciting video by starting off every Friday, what we do best now apparently is eat food. All right guys, I was talking to my cousin and she bought a whole bunch of cereals. And then she told me, you get a toy. And that's basically how this started. And now I want all of them. And uh, if I don't get the Cinnamon Toast Crunch toy, I will keep eating cereal until I find him. No dinners. We are no longer eating dinners in this house until I find the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So yeah, it's pretty cool. There's six different figures. There's Trix Rabbit, the Cinnamon Toast Square, Sunny the Cuckoo, Lucky the Leprechaun, the Cookie Crisp Wolf, and Buzz, uh, Buzz the Bumblebee from- The Honey Bee. The Honey Bee. And um, there's a chance of only 600 made a gold chase. So originally we thought these were a Funko product because they kind of look like mini, mini pocket pops or something, no. but they're not. Uh, they're not Funko related. We just thought it'd be really cool. And since Joanna won last week's duel, I paid for the cereal. So if you guys are also new here, the loser of each week's duel has to buy the winner dinner or in this case breakfast of a meal of some sort but don't worry guys he still owes me pizza <laughs> and we will do pizza next week yes so he's paying for that as well but we also thought this would be a great idea because we've heard a bunch of you guys say that we've been making all of you guys hungry for whatever food we're eating at 9 30 so in the was morning perfect. so now we're going to do breakfast cereal so hopefully some of you guys are currently eating cereal or just ate your breakfast or about to eat breakfast but we're gonna bust open all these boxes and see what we get and we're gonna try each one and uh see which is the best cereal sounds good are you guys a milk first or a oh, cereal god. first oh person? god all right i am a milk person first because i don't like my cereal to get soggy i just eat it quick enough to no. where it's not soggy you just eat it all right we're no. going milk first apparently almond milk almond milk almond is the milk way to first. go so we got five cereals today. Unfortunately, we could not find the Trix cereal, but we do have Cocoa Puffs, Lucky Charms, Honey Nut Cheerios, Cookie Crisp, and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So, so. Cinnamon Toast Crunch and Honey Nut Cheerios has always been my favorite. Yeah, and let us know down in the comments, which cereal do you guys prefer? I'm a Lucky Charms person myself. I haven't had Lucky Charms since I was like three. All right, where's this toy? I found a toy. <gasps> uh, <laughs> that was quick. Oh, I got tricks. Oh my god. I got god. tricks from the Cocoa Puffs box. Guys. Nice. That's it. Video's done. We no longer <laughs> eat, need to eat cereal. This is kind of cool, actually. This is like reliving childhood. <gasps> Except I can't open it. Couldn't open it in your childhood either. Gotta ask your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Right, oh so my it's god. Super tiny. And you like your tiny things. Oh, these are amazing. Look at that. Little tricks. Boom. Right there. Oh my god. It's like the universe <laughs> was just like she worked yeah, so we, hard to find these cereals. And we don't actually have this as a pop yet. So Funko, what are you doing? We need a cinnamon toast square pop. 
And this one's an easy one because you could just do all the different faces. You could have him angry. You uh, could have him like with a crunch missing. This is so cool. All Guys, right. these things are so cool. All right, now we got to taste the cereal. Yes. If you're going to open the toy, you have to eat the cereal. Give me this more. Mmm. Mmm. I love my cinnamon so scrunch. It's literally just a ball of chocolate. Mmm. They don't taste as good as I remember. Maybe because you're not hungry? When you're hungry, cereal is life. Mmm. Mmm. Alright, next box. That was the cinnamon toast crunch, right? Yep. Nice. <clears throat> Got the lucky. Oh, in the lucky box. In the lucky box, yep. All right, I'm doing cookie crisp. Woo, cookie crisp. <laughs> that was pretty good. Where's the toy? Oh. Which one? Nice. I got Kulu. So we got four out of six already. This is pretty good. I worked hard to find these boxes. I went to about six different stores. There, now they're all hanging out. They're all friends. Oh my God, this is so exciting. Now what if we get one of each and I can't find the last one? We will find the last one. We will find it. So if you guys eat all the marshmallows from the Lucky Charms, when you're done, you have to cross out the charms part and you have to write with the sharpie just luckies <laughs> so the next person knows when they open up the box what they're getting into all right cookies ready i haven't had these since i was it's just it's just dessert that we're eating for breakfast now I mean, I know Lucky Charms. Lucky Charms is the best. Mmm. I haven't had this in a while. I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I like this better than the Cocoa Pops. Mm -hmm. Man, I haven't... Man, half of these cereals I haven't eaten in so long. Yeah, this is like... We're like rushing through childhood here. Is it me or the marshmallows used to taste better? It tastes a little chalky. It's like we're famous food critics and they like presented us. Can you imagine on a show? Mm -hmm. <laughs> on like a cooking show, they just present you <laughs> Lucky Charms. <laughs> it took me three hours to make this. <laughs> Honestly, I like just the Lucky. So if you want to eat just the Charms. <laughs> all right. All right, last one. Last one. Oh, this, is the, this is the only cereal that can be somewhat healthy. I love it. Here, you want to you do it? Uh, oh. Another lucky. That's okay. I think we did pretty good. Yeah, we got four of the six. Actually, I'm going to leave it in the bag. Yeah, yeah, leave it in the bag. We'll do a giveaway. Or anybody who wants it. Anybody who doesn't have it. Are you guys collecting cereal? <laughs> All right. I mean, these would be pretty cool display pieces in front of... Pop. I'm already eating. I see that. I think you're going to get yourself another bowl. Mm, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me get some here. Oh, this is really good. Yeah. I think that's when you know you're old. You're an adult, and you're old. When the cereal that says heart healthy on the box <laughs> is your favorite. <laughs> guys, honestly, you guys tell us, but as a kid. When my mom used to bring home the cookie crisp and the cocoa puffs, they just tasted like happiness. Yeah. And now they just taste like... Like you're going to have to go walk some steps. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely the best. All right. I, if I had to go best to worst, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Honey Nut Cheerios, Cookie Crisp, Cocoa Puffs, Lucky Charms. I would go Honey Nut Cheerios... Lucky Charms, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, 
And Cocoa Puffs and Cookie Crisp, they didn't really do it for me. They were both, like, tied for last. So, all right, so Oh, my next... God, we put so much milk Shh, in this bowl. Don't look at the milk. All right, next thing we have up on the chopping block for today's video is we actually have two fan mail boxes from Randy and Jonathan, both really good friends of ours, and they both sent us personalized boxes. So I think we're going to rip these open. We're going to get into those. Okay, so we have some gift boxes from Randy and Jonathan. Huge shout out to you guys for being supporters of the channel. And not only that, two great friends that we are happy to possibly visit in person. Yes. Like upcoming. So uh, looking forward to that. But yeah, we'll Jay Haynes and I are, uh, Jonathan and I are going to get tacos. <laughs> there you go. I'm waiting for that. Oh, double box. Look at that. All right, so I have two pops, it looks like. I have a pop, so you go ahead and open yours first. Cool. I'm so excited. I know. Whenever we get fan mail or any kind of gifts, like, you guys are the best. It's Christmas. It, it's basically Christmas. All right, yeah. I'll go first. <laughs> what do we got? What do we got? Oh, nice. So this is one that I was really excited about oh, getting. Super cool. This is the zombie Mysterio, and yes, he goes in the dark. Look at that. Ugh. That's awesome. There's a lot of detail on that one. Yeah, that's a nice pop. The zombie line is actually pretty cool. I'm hoping they do a zombie Captain America at some point. That'd be kind of cool. You want to open yours? Yes, I'm so excited. So Joanna's a huge fan of the trolls. Shout out to everybody who has sent Joanna some Trolls Pops. I think we have them all now, right? We do we have do. them all. We have completed the troll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, Look you wanted that, that one. It's a DIY yes. one. So oh, I actually... Oh, Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, Pop Shield. Look at you, Jen. Yeah. I see you. I see you. That's how you know, you know, there are yeah. patrons. Because yeah. they know how to pack. The, he double box. He, you know, they just they just got life together. Yeah. So I actually am getting two of these. I got I'm getting one for myself. Mm -hmm. I ordered one as well this week. So I'm getting one for myself because I'm gonna leave one like this, and then I'm gonna DIY one. Like I'm gonna. You're gonna paint it. I'm gonna paint it. Yeah, I'm gonna destroy it. So um, <laughs> thank you so much, Jonathan. I absolutely love it. All right, next one I got. Watch it be a DIY. Oh yes, nice. Oh, this was this one I really line? wanted. No, no, this is in the Spider-Man line. This is from the newest wave, the Scream symbiote. This is a really cool pop. Thank you so much, Randy. You're the man. I love anything Spider-Man. This is this is really cool. And I want to get all the symbiotes, all of them, Venom. Carnage, all of them. So cool. So, thank you. This is freaking awesome. So now, we get to introduce our newest duel uh, here on the channel. We're actually going to be doing a Lego duel instead of a mystery box duel. So, this will work a little bit differently. You want to show off the sets that we will be building today? So, we, are, we went to Target and Walmart. Mm -hmm. Let's just advertise them real quick because we can't live without them. And we got two sets. Future, future sponsors of the channel. <laughs> yeah, if you guys are looking, we we do great content. Um, so we got two sets. Uh, we decided to stick with uh, Star Wars. So we got the Brickheads, uh, the Mandalorian, and the Child. We got Kylo Ren and the Sith Trooper. So we're huge Lego collectors. We love Legos. We love building Legos. But we thought before we jump into some bigger sets, we'd start small. So the rules for today, whenever we do this, we find sets that have similar piece counts. So we try to make it as fair as possible. 295. So mine has 240 pieces, but I will probably need the advantage because Joanna is a much <laughs> faster Lego builder than I am. So we're gonna time our build today and whoever builds Every piece of their set first wins the battle. Sounds pretty sounds pretty simple. Yes. Alright. Ready? I'm ready. Go. Go.
I found where the pieces went. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Oh. Yes. I wonder how quickly that was. But, in your defense, you did have more pieces than I did. Yeah, so look, I legit only needed... You were close. You were close. No, this is how close I was. I'm done. You're done? Yeah. Oh, by seconds. By a mere 10 seconds. Boom. Nice. Oh, that's pretty cool. Put his gun on the back. Well, it looks like I was able to win our very first Lego duel. So, I'm bitter. <laughs> <laughs> I did have an upper hand by about 50 pieces. So this brickhead is from 2018 and I, the Mandalorian, he's brand new. And we have a little treat for you guys today. So we did announce our 750 subscriber giveaway recently, but we're gonna make it a little sweeter because this was our very first Lego duel and we're always looking to give back. This is cool. Yeah, he's really cool. So yeah. we actually picked up another Lego set for somebody who's watching our video right now when we hit 600 subscribers which is not too far off we are going to give somebody this amazing mandalorian brickhead two pack so cool with the child as you guys just saw that we built it so when we hit 600 subscribers all you have to do if you want to get entered in the giveaway for this amazing Lego set is just go hashtag Mando in the comments, get you entered in the drawing and the for giveaway. 600? When we hit 600 subscribers, we'll, we will go live. We will do a nice little celebratory live stream and we will pick a winner for this Lego two pack. As of this afternoon, we are 70 away. That's right, we are 70 away. And don't forget, we are giving away this guy for 750 subscribers. So you got two awesome chances to win some really great Mandalorian prizes just in time for Mandalorian season two. So that was really fun. I had fun. I know you're yeah. upset that you lost. I am upset that I lost. I had a lot of fun. That was, that was tense. That was really tense. Um, I'm excited. I'm excited to build more sets in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let us know in the comments if you want to see more Lego duels on our channel and what types of Lego sets would you like to see us build? Bigger, smaller, more brick heads, maybe a Batmobile? Who knows? Could get pretty crazy. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We really appreciate all the support. Make sure, hashtag Mando in the comments so you don't miss out on your chance to win this amazing Lego set. And as always, here on Slapshot Pops, don't stop shooting until you score. That's right. You don't stop shooting until you score. We will see you guys in the next video.